forest where the lines between earth and sky, snow and clouds start to blur. Bas ek baat saaf hai. This walk in the snow will blow your mind. The Kingfisher Blue Mile has been a rather colourful challenge for all our contestants. From purple sores, red wounds to green eyes, all those who attempted have been through fire and water to emerge true champions at the campouts. And finally, nine of the mightiest have been shortlisted, who will complete the Blue Mile ka epic challenge, the big climb. So get ready to meet our finalists as they brave the winds, bite the cold and sweat some snow as they trek up to the Everest base camp. We are headed to Kathmandu, Nepal. Nine strangers from six campouts held over several days all across the country are about to spend 17 days and nights climbing up to nearly five and a half thousand meters and if that doesn't make your head spin check out the dizzying view Jaise baadal ki unchai se pahaad koi paagal si paheli pooch rahe hain Enough of such shire Time to get our head out of the clouds and our feet back on the ground Kathmandu brings you back to earth, jaldi fast. Business is booming in climbers country. Yes, there are monasteries on every back street here. Buddha is beckoning. And the prayer wheels should take you to a higher plane. But there's also like two backpackers for every local. And our latest arrivals blend right in. Watch this space carefully. Spot any familiar faces from the camp out? You definitely caught him in a frame before. But Pratik usually prefers to stay behind the lens. This is it guys. I finally made it to the final line. It feels like an achievement itself. But the beauty of it all, it's just the beginning. People say the road ahead is difficult and risky and, you know, extremely cold. But what's life without a little bit of risk? As a travel photographer, honestly, I couldn't have asked for more to go up all the way to the Everest base camp and capture the beautiful breathtaking landscapes and the clear blue skies. They say apparently you can't see Mount Everest very clearly from there. But I'm gonna climb it up and check it out for myself. Hamel, Backpackers Paradise. Jahan bhi hum jate hai, wahi mele aate ho. There's always that ek jaga that gives you deja vu. In Nepal, it's Amel, tourist central. More hotels than homes and free Wi-Fi everywhere. For budget travelers, that's the path to instant nirvana. Like Pahar Ganj in Delhi or Khausan in Bangkok, Thamel used to be a hippie haven that's long since been taken over by yuppies. Now, it's the one-stop shop for anything you need and all the stuff you get just for the heck of it. If you don't want to be considered a lightweight, you have to keep that weight light. Aage, chadhai hai. So our finalists kept their wish lists short and sweet. And Naomi, our youngest trekker, had just one wish. To find the piece of her heart she'd left here in the Himalayas. When I first saw the Himalayas, even from a great distance, I was mesmerized. This 
was what actually led me to start trekking and climbing, which eventually turned into a wholesome experience. There's just something about reaching the top of a mountain that took hours to climb. There's that feeling that makes you feel alive and yes, I got addicted to that feeling. I get to satiate this feeling with something even bigger and better. A trek to Everest Base Camp and back. As the youngest of the final climbers, I don't know what to expect but I can't wait for this daring adventure. The last time I was in Nepal, I left a part of me there, so it's time to go back and be whole again. They beat out hundreds of others in a rat race to get here. But now, how do we get them to stop competing and start cooperating? वही बात हुई ना, 900 चूहे खाके बिल्ली हज को चली। पर हमने सोचा, क्यों ना इन 900 को खाना खिला के शॉपिंग ले चलें? In a matter of minutes, the meal had made friends of strangers. After all, they are united in a unique goal. पर जहां नाउमी ये जी और जान से सामना करेगी एन को अपनी भक्ति की शक्ति पर भरोसा है इट टेक्स ऑल सॉर्ट्स टू मास्टर दिस मिशन दिस बाय डिफॉल्ट हैज बिकम माय सुविनर एज एन एग्रीकल्चरलिस्ट आई ऑलवेज हैव लव्ड वेरियस टेरेन्स एंड नेचर As an adventurer, I always love experiencing it in different ways. I jumped off an airplane once, and the thrill was great. I only remember that one moment of pure adrenaline rush. Everything else was a blur. Mountaineering for me too is the same. I only remember that one moment of triumph. Everything else is a blur. climbing mount everest one day and this ebc trek crossing the kumbu glacier coming just short of the kumbu the infamous kumbu ice fall i'm very excited about this and i feel very lucky for an it's about finding the peak within and for arun it's as much about the others as himself हर छोटी सी चीज पे देते हैं पूरा ध्यान और इनके लिए नए दोस्त बनाना है एक निजी दास्तान आई एम एन ऑन्ट्रो फ्रनो आई लव फूड आई लव पीपल आई लव एंटरटेनिंग एंड इवन बींग एन एटर्नल प्रॉब्लम सॉल्व बट अबव एवरीथिंग आई जस्ट लव एडवेंचर द रश द वाइब द एनर्जी इट जस्ट कैन बी रिप्लेस I had the chance to trek to hills and small mountains till now, but this time, life has played me a big and fair hand. I'm going to trek up to the Mount Everest base camp in Nepal. Just never imagined this happening. Just the sound of taking on such a big challenge, and that too with strangers and on TV. It's just no wrecking. Being from the southernmost part of India, it's extremely exciting to navigate to the top. and see the world from a very different place and 
with a different perspective. All I can say is, bring on the blue mile.